Hello everybody, I'm Storm here. Welcome back to Workers and Resources, Soviet Republic. In the last episode, we built this brand new coal mine with four new actual mines, uh, a processing plant, an aggregate storage, and an aggregate loading train station uh, to eventually be able to move this coal around. So, you know, we got all that built. It did kind of rinse our cash. Um, quite a bit. Uh, we only have about 200 grand left in the bank. So, we're going to need to be a little bit careful about what we currently spend money on. The, I think the plan right now is going to be... ...to hook this station up to the, to the rail network as it exists. Um, might want to rework some of this, um, which is fine. We could rework this so that we could then proceed to bring the, the rail up here and let it bypass through there. We'll see, or I can just bring it past there. Bring like the rail around here and, and join it in. I'll, I'll figure it out as far as how the rail is going to work. And then we're going to need to just kind of export the coal for a while. Um, because the next project, which is also going to be very expensive, is going to be building an iron mine out this way around here. We're going to set up an iron mine. Once we have an iron mine, then we can build a steel mill and start making steel. And once we have steel, we can actually start probably building our own residential buildings. Sort of. Because to build the simplest residential buildings, these brick flats. Right. Prefab flats needs prefab panels, which uh, we don't have yet. But to build the flats, br the brick flats, um, we need concrete, which we have gravel, we have cement, we can make concrete. Um, we need more gravel, so that's going to be another project we're going to have to throw into this. But you know, gravel and cement, concrete, not hard. Gravel, we've got it. Asphalt, we can make it. Boards, we're starting to make those. We're probably going to have to export those as well um, here. Um, bricks, the bricks just need... Actually, that should be unpaused right now and letting this thing run. In fact, we should probably be running at a high speed. Um, the bricks, um, a brick factory, the only thing it consumes is coal. So once we have this coal plant, this coal mine up and running... We can build a bricks factory easy and start cranking out bricks. Um, so then that just leaves steel. And for steel, we just need some iron. And once we have steel... Oh, good. Now, prefab panels. What do you actually need? You need cement. Okay, gravel. Cement and gravel. That's, that's not hard either. That's not hard either. So if we get both bricks and and prefab panels going, we can start building our own, and steel, of course, we can start building our own residential buildings. Which would be great. Right now what we need is we need to get this road built, which the road is currently under construction. You might need another construction office. Because this one is a little bit too far away. Hmm. Not cheap. But I think I think it's probably right. We need another construction office. Alright then. Uh actually it needs to be under here. 
Rail construction office. Interesting. I'm not sure what that does. Helicopter construction office. We're going to have to auto build it. Actually, what's required? Concrete, gravel, asphalt, bricks, boards, steel. Yeah, we're going to have to buy it. It's cheap, only six grand, so yeah. yeah. Won't be too big of a deal. Drop it in. Let's hope that it can get everything it needs. Workers. You can pick up workers from there. Gravel, you can pick up gravel from there. Asphalt, you can pick up from there. We don't have a concrete plant yet. We don't have a steel plant. We don't have a brick plant. None of that yet. Asphalt plant can't produce asphalt. Sure it can. Well, yeah, all of our um, bitumen is, is being consumed. But, I mean, it's all right. Some of it can get redirected when we, you know, when we demand it. That guy's still filling up. That guy's still filling up. All right. We're going to need some stuff here. We need some mechanisms. You're going to need a bus. Um, let's go with a cheap bus. Maybe not a micro bus. 32 passengers. 52 passengers. Yeah, let's go with one of these. There you go. A bus. You're going to need a bulldozer. At least one. That'll do. A uh, concrete mixer. Not yet. Covered hull. Yeah, we need a covered hull. No, we don't need a covered hull. No, we don't need cover hulls. Dumpers. We are going to need the dumpers. You're using these as dumpers, right? We got a couple of those. We need an, at least one excavator. Let's go with the cheap one. Open hull is the one we need. We need something that can at least hold six tons. Yeah, we'll just go with you. You can be an open hull. Um, a paver. And a roller. Road cranes, we're probably going to need a concrete mixer. We're probably going to need at some point. But for now, you're fine. All right. Not sure why it's not picking up that the construction office is in range. Unless we need this particular stretch of road to be done first. Possibly. But having a construction office there is not a bad idea. We are exporting something. It looks like the bitumen train has... Uh, made its way to the border. Indeed. And it unloaded its entire cargo. Good deal.
Production this building was stopped. It seems to be operating fine right now. Probably just lost some workers for a minute. And I'm sure we probably finished our research. Advanced engineering. Semiconductors. Advanced engineering. Let's go for that first. We have a lot of students waiting for professors. Is there a building that could be potentially cheap? 43 worker brick flat. Auto invite immigrants using rubles. No, don't get citizens. Let's just build it. No one lives here. No, because I told no one to live there. What I want to do... Invite five immigrants from the Soviet bloc. Invite a whole bunch of expert immigrants. There we go. Hopefully they can work as... Uh, actually, can I tell you? You are going to work in the university. So basically, it's a little dorm for the uh, for the professors and other staff. So that's uh, that's fine. Unfinished road. Yeah, let me see what happens there. How's this road doing? Needs a bunch of asphalt and needs some workers. Oh. We can bring workers in. Asphalt's being delivered. The paper's getting the job done. Now, there's another issue over here we need to resolve. Is it this? You don't have any power supply. Is that these substations did not quite cover as much as I would have liked. This does power all of the various conveyor equipment, but doesn't power you know all of the mines. And we need this mine here powered as well. So we need a couple more. 
substations. Now, can I get a substation in that can power both of those? Yes. But I'm going to have to put it in the middle of nowhere. All right. Just throwing some dirt road because it doesn't cost me anything. All right, now I need to figure out how we're gonna make this work. What we're gonna need is we're gonna need two switches. So we're gonna need to pull this out, right? Yep, and then we're going to need a medium voltage switch. And we're going to need one over here. Right? Yep, we're going to need one over here. And we're going to need one... Here-ish? Okay. And then we're going to need the underground wire. We're going to need underground wire running over there. We're going to need underground wire here. We're going to need that to connect there. And then this. Hmm. Actually, no. We need to do it the other way around. This one connects there. And then this one runs over here. There we go. Electricity problem. I know, I just severed the electricity. The price of oil in the global markets is going down. Well, the price of oil may be going down, that's fine. As long as the price of the products that can be derived from oil does not go down, that will help. All right, so you're loading up on fuel. That's our cement. It's almost not worth exporting this stuff. Uh, we'll keep exporting it because, you know, we can. There's the coal. That's barely worth anything either, but again, it's worth something. Forty-two workers can't work because there is no kindergarten. What? Well, it's probably because this kindergarten is full. Unable to participate in any sport. Okay. Those two issues can be resolved. And, um, not too expensive either. Because if citizens are unable to work, then that's not good. So we need you to be able to work. throw a tennis court and a soccer pitch in here. Let's see if we can. Let's, let's throw you in there. Let's throw you in here. 
and then put that. Yes. Those footpaths we can build ourselves. Looks like the multiple construction offices can be assigned to the same. Yeah, and looks like we need to do the first in the line before the set next ones will pick up. Okay. Building is on fire. Where? Where is the building on fire? Okay. Uh, fire department. Are, are, are you uh, dispatching? Yep, there's the one of our vehicles. Get it taken care of. Oh, we are harvesting. Combines in the field. Props. We've got some props. I'm really curious to see what three large fields will we'll bring in. Did I get another covered hull? Yeah, let's get a second one going. Oh, yeah. Oh, you're still offloading crop off of this field. Harvest of crops ready for transport. 62.48 tons. Then we, yeah, we really do need more, uh, more covered hulls. situation report. It was really severe acute cases of the infection. The disease is causing citizens severe health complications. It seems this disease is not very infectious and will not spread easily through the population. It seems it's just a seasonal event and according to our experts, this infection should disappear soon. Good. And then and, and hopefully our experts are correct. Not just telling us what we want to hear. All right, how we doing? All right, next piece of road is under construction. Just needs some asphalt. Which is being delivered. Should I have you waiting until you're unloaded? Really? You know what? No. 
Go ahead and don't wait till you're unloaded. We do need to move both the gravel and the coal, so I can't have you sitting here waiting to unload coal while we have gravel that can be moved. Alright, everybody's turned on. Everybody's turned on, good. Okay, I don't think that resource loads in this game are limited. I'm pretty sure they aren't. As long as we keep the power plant full of coal, Last chance to buy. Yeah, I don't care. As long as there is a replacement, then that's fine. I think at this point, what we really need to do is sell our hands. Yeah, now we're starting to move the crop. Good, good. Almost 300 tons. We might need a second silo. Wow, those uh, those trees really grew in, didn't they? And uh, this is full. This is full of boards. Okay. No. Resources available. Cargo train station can't handle boards. Hmm. But here's what we're going to do for the time being. Because buying a train is going to be too expensive. In September, this field's being harvested. We've managed to pull everything off of that field. We've managed to pull everything off of this field. How expensive is it to build rack? Not cheap. I think I need to. Set up our signals.
Alright, then you're gonna need that. You're gonna need one about there. That one should be okay. I need to worry about... No, no. We won't need to worry about that. Or would I? Oh, let's just put one right there. Okay, and then we're going to need... Chain signal there and there. Actually, no, we don't need. Ch oh, wrong way. Yes. And then we need two way signals there and there. Just keeps having trouble keeping a consistent workers. Now, what we're also going to do here is... Oh, that's trolley bus. Where's my road depot? There. Um, we need... Belled tree capacity. Boards. 12 tons of boards. Oh, what's this? Price of coal on the global markets is going down, so that means that our already not very good coal is going to be worse. Oh, nuts. 70 kilometers per hour, 60 kilometers per hour. I guess these guys are going to be good. Give me a couple of those. All right. You. You are going to pick up boards. Probably don't really need to specify. Load there and drive them to the border for ex exports. Pushing those boards to the border. I think what I would need to do is something like this. Actually, connection between factories. Can't cross the road. I don't think. Factory connection crossing. Is 
thing is, I don't think that can cross roads. I don't want to demolish that. Well, I'll have to think about it. How I want to handle that instead. I may just need a different stop. Now, how expensive is the train? Very. And our cargo wagons, they can carry... Crops. Yeah. We're probably going to have to use trucks. Got another hundred tons. How expensive is a food processing plant? Rather. Another thing to think about. But I think we're at the end of the episode here, so... We'll go ahead and stop here. Still waiting for these roads to get built. Let's get in there. In the meantime, I think I probably just need to let stuff get exported and stop spending money. Only 56 tons? I mean, I'll take what I can get, but... I'd rather that have been a full load. What's the value of those boards? 144. As I said, we'll stop here, and uh, we'll keep working when we come back. So for now, hope you guys enjoyed it. Thanks for watching. Go ahead, like, subscribe, and comment, and I will see you next time.